Yo, what's good with it? Welcome back to A1 Who's Zone. Back at y'all another one, man. But before we jump into this, make sure you hit that like button. Sub to the channel if you're new. Um, hey, we're gonna dive right into this, man. We got day two, the NBA playoffs kicking off. Who we got up on this on this prediction video? We got the Miami Heat versus the Milwaukee Bucks, man. Uh, let's dive into this joint. Not gonna be too long-winded on this one at all, man. Um, he, you know, what I'm saying they they did what they had to do. They get they beat the Bulls to get themselves a lock in, obviously into that AC. And um, you know, well, <laughs> what what can you say, man? Uh, their their reward for getting in is having to play against the Bucks in the first round, man. Uh, obviously, they they got some some history, um, you know, what I'm saying Jimmy Butler and the, and the Heat versus Giannis and the and the Bucks, man. But this is going to be different this time around. Uh, why is that? I feel like this Heat team again. They 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 did what they had to do to you know, what I'm saying win the game to get themselves in. <laughs> But this uh, this Milwaukee Bucks team, you know, obviously they won a chip, man, and they're getting back to everybody's being healthy. Middle Chris Middleton's out there, uh, obviously Giannis is out there, Drew Holiday. So they're they're three headed monster. They got obviously they got a solid bench, Brooke Lopez. Um, so they, they they got a team that's built around being able to play different different styles of basketball. Uh, obviously we're not gonna forget about Bobby Portis. So yeah, they 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 got a team that's built to play different facets of basketball. Now with the Heat. Um, it's one of them situations, man, where they, they ran, they're, they're running up into a juggernaut. And I don't know if they have the offensive firepower to keep up with that team, uh, from an offensive standpoint, a lot of people look at the, the, the bucks and they don't understand that's a high power team. You know, they can put up a lot of points in a hurry. Um, and that's, I think that's going to be the case and what we're going to see, uh, if I'm being quite honest with y'all, man, I think, um, looking at this game and how they're going to approach it. Yeah. It's, it's, it's going to be high powered offense. And then there's going to obviously be some, some defense being played from the bucks. Cause they're one of the top defensive teams in the league. So the Miami Heat, they're, they're going to have their hands full. Absolutely going to have their hands full. Um, you know what I mean? So they're going to need Jimmy Butler to go out there and play off, you know what I'm saying, play like playoff Jimmy Butler. They're going to need Bam Adebayo to go out there and perform at an all-star caliber level. They're going to need, you know what I'm saying, uh, Tyler Hero. They're going to need everybody. They're going to need all hands on deck in order for them to stand a chance, let alone winning game one, but a chance in the series. You know what I mean? But. Uh, again, now I didn't want to be long winded, but who do I have? You know, for for this particular prediction, I'm rocking out the Milwaukee Bucks, man. I feel like they're gonna make a statement, come out, let it be known that, you know, for the Heat that hey, we we not gonna play around with y'all, shorthanded or not, whatever y'all got going on, we don't care. We're gonna come out here and you know what I'm saying we gonna we gonna definitely put it down on y'all, let y'all know, y'all don't deserve to be playing against us, and we're not gonna play with y'all to give y'all any type of confidence. So I think uh, this this game one is gonna be an ugly game, <laughs> and that's no disrespect or anything to the Heat. Um, if I'm being quite honest, Joe, I, I would not be surprised if the Heat managed to not only stay into the game to stick around, but also, you know what I'm saying, they might be able to pull it off just off the verses of, you know what I'm saying, the Bucks getting so much rest. And the Heat obviously have been playing more, so it's allowing them to kind of stay in, stay in the flow and rhythm of the game. So we'll have to wait and see if it's a battle of, you know what I'm saying, uh, have, playing more or getting too much rest. But again, I, I think the, the Bucks are, are, you know what I'm saying, championship pedigree team, so they're not going to allow themselves to fall into that lull. So I, I got the Bucks winning this one, man. But that's all I got for y'all. I appreciate you stopping through. Make sure you hit that like button, sub to the channel if you're new. Leave a comment in the comment section. I'll be sure to respond to each and every one of y'all. And if you wish to support the channel, that information is scrolling at the bottom of the screen. It's also in the description of the video. Again, man, I appreciate you stopping through, and I'll catch y'all on another one.